what is up everyone and welcome to my second video for today based around the world cup france versus poland quick note i have france beating poland in the round of 16 by the score line of 2-0 so that is why i'm playing as france now i did recently upload like five minutes ago argentina versus australia and i know that that versus was basically an intercontinental versus oceans away and i really couldn't do that much because you know it's uh argentina really doesn't have that large of a military plus it's hard to do a landfall invasion especially against a nation like australia so all i really did was take control of the island of tasmania and that's the least i can do so it's something better than nothing this time around it's going to be much better much more action-packed because we're in europe now so no surprises here france large military poland no slouch out no slouch either excuse me i've played as poland before and I've played against them numerous of times so they're a tough nut to crack I've deployed most of my military already for France so I'm gonna send those units that way and there are more World Cup versus to come I know that uh, Morocco Croatia are the other two nations that have qualified then there's um, Japan and Spain so those will be the next verses that I'll be doing double McTufer. Okay, guys, uh, let's keep sending our units over there. I made treaties already, non-aggression packs, full transit treaties with the numerous European nations, so that way I can enter their borders and invade Poland. Let's see if I can try to make this versus as fast as possible. Deploy my air units too. Gonna have them on standby. Let's bring them to a base here in Germany. Let's see. Air base, air base, air base. Maybe the Czech Republic will do. Yeah. Let's send them to the Czech Republic. I don't know why the game's lagging. Hmm. Okay. I don't know why I keep getting tipped. I disabled that. The tips are still showing up. Got an offer. No, thank you. Is this really it? Yeah, that's really it. Wow. Okay. Let's get this war on the road, shall we? Good luck to both teams in the uh, in the round of 16. I got France, though. So anything goes. A lot of dark horse, a lot of underdogs in the World Cup now. Let's retreat for now. So far, so good, actually. I'm not, I, I like it. I like the way this is turning out. Much better than <laughs> Argentina versus Australia, am I right? Those are artillery units, man. I'm gonna have to take that fabrication base, I think, since it's bothering me the most. Oh, yeah, they don't like that at all. Wow. This is why I never like invading Poland, even to this day. So many artillery units everywhere for Poland. Which hurt my units a lot. That's the thing. It just keeps sending them. Left and right. I hope that's it. Nope, we still got some more stragglers. Damn. I'm gonna have to take that barracks there. Next to the German border. I don't want to check the stats yet. Not until the uh, end game here. However, it's, been, it's versus going much quicker than the other. Just because... I don't have to like cross oceans and you know make landfall invasions. It's a close, it's a close border war. I'm not bordering Poland, but you know what I mean. Let's 
we're in the same area. Europe. Close proximity. I always want to destroy those auxiliary units. It's bothering me the most. Keep bombarding me from miles away. There we go. Warsaw, Warsaw, still a ways away. I didn't even realize. Oh goodness! You know what? No, let's leave that village away. Leave that village alone. North Korea has declared war on South Korea. Oh, a thousand? No, a million dollars. Then North Korea gets eliminated by the end of this versus a million dollars. I got it. All right, let's push on here. <laughs> Dude, it wasn't. Th that wasn't even 30 seconds. That was more like, what, 10, 15 seconds when I said that I would put a bet of a million dollars on North Korea getting eliminated by the end of this versus, and it only took like 10, 15 seconds for them to be eliminated. Ah, uh, North Korea never changes. Two more villages down here. There. Come on, there we go. Still gotta wait for supplies though. Guys, again, <laughs> gotta sponsor this. If you wanna support me on Patreon, there's a link below. It means so much. If you enjoy this type of content and love what I upload, please take the time to support me. All it costs is a small cookie. A small cup of coffee it's all it takes I mean that's on you I'm not forcing anyone that's your choice but it means so much that it keeps the motivation going for uploading supreme ruler content especially with 2030 around the corner I can't wait for that so I want to have as many supporters as possible and for my old viewers and also new viewers to come check out supreme ruler 2030 the next big strategy game by Battle Goat Studios. If you love 2020, if you love Ultimate, 2030. I'm patient and I'm ready to upload videos for it. All right, we're close. We're very, very close. Gotta just take the village out, the fabrication base. All right, send the rest of the units. We're also gonna send our air units combined assault going on now. I was talking about that in my England versus Senegal video. I was muted, but I love combined assaults in Supreme Ruler. This is why Supreme Ruler to this day is still my favorite RTS game of all time. Irreplaceable. It's a comfy game, cozy game that I can just jump in casually. And I probably won't ever play other strategy games, so don't ever tell me to play like Hearts of Iron Europa, okay? Just Supreme Ruler. Thank you, Battlego Studios. Thank you. <laughs> All right, there we go. Oh, that's right. I was supposed to colonize. That was the other thing that I was also talking about. I am remembering small details now, but I didn't. Oh, I couldn't do it with Australia since I didn't take them or annex them, I should say. However, with Poland. I should do that because I did that with uh, the US against the Netherlands. I colonized them just for giggles, just for fun. I did that with England against Senegal. I colonized Senegal. So just because it's the World Cup versus, I'm just going to colonize. So I got to go here. Uh, I think it was. Here we go. Return as colony. Just for the purpose of the uh, the World Cup. I don't know why, but I'm just colonizing the nations I annex. So there we have it. French Poland <laughs> is here. Let's check the stats real quick. 256 unit kills, 24 unit losses. 
South Korea this time, 934 unit kills against North Korea. North Korea fell much quicker here though. But there we have it guys. Poland has been colonized and I have France beating Poland 2-0 in the World Cup. But tell me what you guys think or tell me who you think will win in that matchup and the other matches matches that I mentioned and who you want to win in the World Cup. Again guys, check out my Patreon. There's a link below to unlock exclusive rewards and shoutouts. Check out my Twitch. I've been streaming a lot more often for Supreme Ruler and I will certainly do that more next week. And one quick thing, I've never said this before, I've never mentioned it, but turn on that notification bell. If you love my content, if you love my videos, turning on that notification will tell you that I am uploading uh, Supreme Ruler videos or any video in general. So that's something that I should probably mention in the beginning of my videos from here on out. So guys, as always, subscribe, like, Turn on that notification bell for updates on my videos, and I will see you guys next time.